What's going on everybody? Farley here and tonight I want to talk about a package that I got from none other than uh, Chris over at What Lurks on Channel X. Uh, Chris is a great guy man. I've been friends with him now for over a year. Uh, met him through uh, YouTube. Uh, originally we were both in the vinyl community showing mostly vinyl and uh, we've kind of both branched out at the same time showing comics and you know other things that we pick up Chris has shown a lot of different things you know over the last year and a half from um, vinyl to CDs to cassettes to also uh, collectibles uh, he likes a lot of the old horror stuff and uh, comic books and so he's just a genuinely really good dude one of my uh, really good friends that I've met and uh, he's somebody that I talk to outside of YouTube, and I uh, really enjoy our friendship. So thanks so much for sending this. I really, really owe you because this is two packages now. So I'll get you back, I promise. All right, so that being said, if you're not subscribed to What Lurks on Channel X, uh, please go do so. Uh, matter of fact, go do it now and then come back. should leave a link down below somewhere. So come back. All right, so this is the package. You can always tell it's a uh, package from Chris because of the black tape. He makes sure everything is secure. So he's better than most uh, eBay sellers in that respect. So I've already uh, opened it up. I haven't looked in it yet. So let's go ahead and start. So I'm just going to grab random stuff. Oh. He sent me a um, outer sleeve for vinyl record. Thanks, man. I actually need a few of those. All right. Let's see here. Oh, sweet, dude. So another thing about Chris is that he has toured and uh, been the uh, we call it, drum tech for uh, Anthrax and um, Charlie Benante's drum tech. So he's in real cool with the uh, with the band. Which blows me away, by the way. But he sent me a little poster of none other than Frank Bello, one of the best bassists ever. So, awesome, man. Appreciate that. All right. I've never seen this picture before. Artist approved. Zoom. I don't know. I don't know if it's from, like, a an ad for the bass or what. It's pretty cool, though. All right. Hey, he sent me some more. All right. More of these. Try not to look. Some more. Bam. I can always use record sleeves. All right. There's all kinds of stuff floating around in here. Oh, yeah. Forever Metal. Uh, that is the... I think, it, if I'm not mistaken... Uh, Chris run the website uh, for Forever Metal, which I think is um, Charlie Benante's website, where they do like coffee and t-shirts and stuff, like this one he sent me before. So there's a uh, patch, and then we got some cool skull stickers. Yeah. And then that one. Can't see that one, can you? Yeah, I wonder if it's glows in the dark, this one. All right. All right, got DVD. Ah, No Hit Wonders. 1985 to 1991, the videos. Uh, I have, on VHS, I have, uh, what is it, Oda or whatever it's called. Nice uh, fucking video. But I did not have this. But this is the videos from 85 to 91. This is bonus band video commentary, and uh, let's see, Madhouse MTV version, and I'm the man, live montage. So sweet. Whoa, is this signed? Holy cow, look at this. Autographed. I can't make out all of them. I think I got Scotty Ian. Yeah, man, that's freaking sweet. Love me some anthrax. So, 
That's awesome, man. I appreciate that. The autograph action. Ah, oh, this is the one I've got on VHS. Now I've got it on DVD. Nice fucking video. Sweet, dude. I've had this three or four times in my life. Always on VHS. Never had the uh, DVD. But one of my favorite, favorite uh, metal uh, VHS tapes. Now, on DVD. All right. All right. All right. Cassettes. There's two. Oh, this is one of his mixtapes. Yeah, mosh it up. Uh, he he did a mixtape and sent those out a while back. And so he sent me one. Uh, just some classic thrash on here. <clears throat> Got Slayer, Metallica, Megadeth, Death Angel, Exit, Testament, Nuclear Assault, uh, Anthrax, Overkill, M.O.D., Hate Tank. Love that song. Celtic Frost, King Diamond, Sacred Reich, Flossum and Jetsum. Every song on here. A winner. So, yeah, man. That's freaking sweet, dude. Mixtapes. Uh, I've got um, Travis uh, over at Lyricide 17 sent me one, too. And I've been jamming out to it. So, love it. <laughs> Jackal. He must have saw the video, or did we talk about them, uh, where I saw Jackal years ago in Atlanta before they got big. Uh, and I'm talking, like, probably 90 Somewhere in that neighborhood. And I can still remember uh, there was two other bands from Atlanta on there. Masada and Mesa Bones. But what I can remember from that show is uh, Jack was coming out with a chainsaw. So, and it was like two years later, they were all TV. And I was like, oh, I remember those guys. So sweet, dude. Appreciate it. it brings back a lot of memories. All right. And now I think we've got magazines or comics. Oh, sweet. It's the Aaron Cooter. Um, what do they call it? The Young Guns or whatever cover for uh, Venom. That's awesome. We've got another Venom. Mike Del Mundo cover. This is a variant. I don't know if this is a Young Guns cover. Look at that. I'm telling you, some of the best artwork is being done in that Venom series. And this is the Stegman cover for Venom. Yeah, man, I'm telling you, Stegman, he's killing it with, with Venom. And we got some of the new, they just started a new series back over at one, but this is the volume right before it. Uh, this is the Punisher when he gets, um, what's his name, Rhodes from, uh, Rhodes from, uh, crap, why am I having brain drain? Iron Man, the uh, Rhodes War Machine armor, they put the Punisher in that in his last series. So this is when he was wearing the War Machine's armor. These are all cool as heck, and I needed these. I ain't got so much in here, man. I appreciate it, dude. So, so in the new series that just started with Punisher, they've taken him out of the armor and just put him back on the street. So he's back on the street, back to his old Punisher self. So cool, man. Really love the Punisher, dude. All right, let me see what else. I've never seen this before in my life. But this is so sweet. Look at this. Bring the Noise featuring Chuck D from Public Enemy. Love this song, man. I did not know this album existed. And it's a picture disc, so we're going to take a look at it. Look at that old uh, ghetto blaster on the back. Oh, my goodness. This is... Awesome, dude. I did not know this existed. This is a limited edition number 2487 on the back. 
Oh, this is some really cool package in here. I don't even know how to open this thing. Okay. Wow. Wow. Holy cow, look at this. Sorry. <laughs> Dude, I've never, ever seen this before in my life. But I do know the song. Matter of fact, my band, we used to play a version of Bring the Noise. Uh, I would include some of the lyrics. And we would do it to Smoke on the Water. It's really, really cool the way we did it. But, dude, that's awesome. Limited edition Anthrax Bring the Noise picture disc. Had no idea this existed, but I do now. What is this, playing cards? So it's Anthrax. <laughs> Look at this. That's cool, man. Anthrax playing cards. So I'll just pull one out and show it to you. There's the back. Sorry about the glare. And then the front. <laughs> I've never seen these either. Dude, that's sweet, man. Can't get over how much stuff you sent, bro. Okay. These are just some empty, uh, empty comic book bags and boards. I can use those as well. Okay. <laughs> so. Chris, this last package, he sent me some really uh, big grails I'd been after. Um, nuclear assault I'd been after. He gave me an original pressing of a Justice for All, which I'd never owned. Um, I had a repress. But the last time he sent me something, it was freaking overwhelming. And he's done it again, dude. He sent me my number one grail. Testament practice what you preach. I've been after this album probably since I started the uh, in the uh, vinyl community. And I talked about all my grails. And between me buying some and Chris and some of my other good friends uh, in the vinyl community sending me things, I've really, really got a lot of stuff off of my list. And I really don't have that big a list anymore, but this is one that's still on it. And this is freaking sweet, dude. This is an awesome copy. This is an original press. Again, I I don't even know if there's been a repressing of this album. Um, I haven't seen one. There might be some European repressings, but I don't have any U.S. But this is the original Megaforce pressing. Dude, I'm blown away. I'm blown away by this, dude. I, this is too much stuff, man. Sorry, got some more of these. Chris Hansen. Chris Hansen just sent. Oh, somebody's at the door. Hold on one second. All right, so I'm back. Had a neighbor come by real quick and uh, in the middle of this, so sorry about that. But uh, the hardest album. That I've ever tried to find is this one right here. And he sent it to me. Dude, what are you doing getting rid of your Chromax? I mean, don't get me wrong, I'll take it, but wow. Age of Coral, the best hardcore album of all time. It's right up there with Sick of It All. Dude, I'm blown away by all of this, dude. This is amazingly generous of you. And, uh, I actually feel bad because I, I it, uh, yeah, it overwhelms me. And I feel bad because, dude, you're getting rid of some awesome records, man. But if they have to go, what better place to go than here? But uh, thanks once again, Chris. You're an awesome guy, awesome friend. 
Not just because you send me really cool stuff, but because you're really down to earth. You're a good person to talk to. We share a lot of the same interests. And, uh, yeah, I appreciate you. I appreciate your friendship uh, and your channel. Uh, one thing about your channel is you do what you want to do on your channel. And you're kind of like me. It doesn't really matter about the subscriptions. We just show what we want to show. And I appreciate you for that, too. So uh, just a great person, great channel. And uh, I'm blown away. Blown away as usual by your packages, man. So thanks once again. And uh, I got some work cut out for me to get you back. Take care, everybody. Follow out. All right, so I just found a couple more things in the box. I'm gonna... Oh, there's more. All right, this is the box that uh, never ends right here. But, uh, yeah, I've got, uh, he sent me one of these before. It's the Anthrax uh, Permanent Marker in Blue. He sent me some picks before, but I didn't get this one. Uh, this is Frank Bellow pick. Sorry. And a Forever Metal Keychain. So, sorry I didn't see those uh, on the first two videos. But uh, he also sent me a really kind note. Uh, because you're so awesome. Uh, enjoy this and I hope you like the stuff dude I'm blown away by it. I think you know that because <laughs> every time you send me something I'm blown away so yeah you sure you want me to have these albums man I cannot believe this I can't believe this and the, and the anthrax which is underneath some comics but okay uh, thanks again man you rock and I'll talk to you soon Farley out